WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday. Three hours left to go in the trading day. We got a mixed market out there right now. Dow Jones negative by 56 points, trading 26,776. NASDAQ positive by 51 points, trading at 8,171. And the S&Ps right now flat, trading at 3,005. Gold catching a bid back above 1,500. Gold trading up $8 at 1,503.80. Oil, another positive day, extending the big gains we had yesterday. Oil contract up 39 cents at 56.37. Notes and bonds, a little bit of higher price and lower yield. The 10-year up three ticks at 129.30. The 30-year up 11 ticks at 160.14. And the dollar index with a little strength up 163 ticks at 97.654. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the charts. We'll see if those charts are loading. There's a lot going on in the market, folks, and these charts are a little bit delayed. Gold not quite coming up. We'll pull it up on the Bloomberg if we must. We're going to start it off with the crude oil chart. How about it? Making session highs as we speak, $56.46. For a little bit of context, back this baby up. And how about the low from yesterday at 9 a.m.? 53.63. We're approaching $3 in the span of just over 24 hours in that price of crude. S&Ps currently trading at 3,005. Two troughs throughout the day, making it right at around 300 and bouncing off that level. NASDAQ 100, a little bit of a different story, approaching the highs of the session, currently trading 79.62. There's your Dow, the laggard of the day, Dow Jones trading 26,723. And the euro US dollar on the day we have an ECB meeting, we get Mario Draghi's final press conference and the euro trading just above 111 actually dipped below that briefly. The euro trading 111.08. Terms of what else you have happening across the market, we are big into earnings season. Amazon with their earnings after the bell tonight, Amazon up about 1.1% right now coming into that number, up $20.81, trading at $17.82. The number to look for here, we're on the Analyze tab of the Thinkorswim platform, the expected one-day move, $63.65 as we await the Amazon earnings after the bell. That basically the volatility that is priced in one way or the other, so no direction, $63 if you were playing one-day options. That's what they're looking for on that move. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Steve Rhodes coming up right now at the Trader's Edge. Dave White live at 2 o'clock with the Power Trading Hour and Tom O'Brien live at 3. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back with Steve Rhodes.